They're taking a pure electric signal and sculpting it into something of beauty. The point that I'm trying to make right now is I want to show y'all what they don't tell you about moving. clean now um, I just finished taking my shower I've been kind of doing some last-minute packing type stuff just trying to organize everything um, I definitely want to take some stuff on my trip to the apartment so I'm gonna load my car up first with like suitcases and stuff that is easier for me to carry out y'all look at where I had to sleep last night this was my bed last night so let's just say my back hurt and my hips hurt and um, yeah so I'm a little tired. I woke up earlier. Let me put you guys down. I woke up earlier than I was supposed to um, because that's how my nerves get me. Um, I wake up, I wouldn't say in a panic, but I just woke up like, oh my goodness, this has to be done. This has to be done. Um, but for the most part, I'm pretty chill now. Very anxious though. And um, just trying to get this last minute stuff done. Um, so yeah, that's what I'm about to do. What I'm about to do right now is clean out my trunk um, because it's a lot of old uniforms. Because it's a lot of old uniforms and um, just junk back there. I need that space so I can pack up my car. So I'm about to clean it up. Okay, so right now I'm on my way to the bank, um, but before I go to the bank, I have to make two stops. Um, I just packed up my trunk. I didn't pack up the back seat because, um, like I said in the previous video, the area I moved to is a little sketchy and I just don't want to bring attention to my car. So I just put everything in the truck and then once we get the van, well, once the rental truck gets here, then that's when I'll, you know, put everything in there. Um, it's like, what else is that for? So I might as well just wait. Um, I'm a little blown right now. It's raining. I didn't even take weather into consideration today, so I'm just hoping it clears up. So I'm in the new place. I like it. It's decent. One thing I have a reservation about, which which I didn't know before I moved in here. When she said first floor, I thought it meant like a floor up, not literally the first floor, because she told me it was a terrace floor. So I was thinking like, oh, like their floor is a terrace, and then I'll be on another floor, which will actually have a real balcony. I have like a patio, and I will show you guys the outside, but for privacy, but for privacy reasons. Um, I'm not going to show you guys that. Um, so that was a little disappointing, but I'm going to make the best of it. Um, I'm about to go out and head to the internet service store so I can get my box and hopefully install it today, maybe tomorrow, so I can have some internet and, um, use my computer and watch movies and stuff. To be honest, that's not even a concern right now. I'm really just, like, nervous about this level but um i'm looking at my like options and of like privacy and trying to take care of that so we'll see um but for the most part 
it's a decent apartment um but it's decent it serves my needs and yeah um so i guess i can give you a tour this is my bathroom this is my bedroom this is my living room this is my dining room this is my kitchen the reason i'm not showing you guys everything is because i want to do a furnished apartment uh tour like i said this is not a luxury apartment it's not too much to see in here so i wanted to be decorated and kind of like put my personality in it before i show you guys because that's going to be worth seeing not the empty apartment so again i'm happy i'm I want to say 100% satisfied, but it's an apartment, it's a place to live, and I'm thankful and I'm grateful. So, um, I guess the next time you guys see me, I will be moving my stuff into this apartment. So... Alright, so... I moved in. Um, sorry I didn't get any footage of us physically moving me in because it got really hectic last night we was running super 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 behind and um i just wanted to get my stuff in this apartment so filming wasn't a uh, priority but i'm back and um i'm about to eat first because i'm like starving i have like a headache uh and i guess i can tell you guys about my first night here so let's go I went to 7-Eleven. I woke up first and went to 7-Eleven. And I got me some donuts and a hot dog because I've been just really focusing on my health during this move. But yeah, let me tell you guys about my first night. So unfortunately I had to spend the night alone. I didn't really ask anybody to spend a night with me. Um, not consciously, just thinking like, oh, nobody's gonna spend a night with me. More so like, I don't wanna burden anyone, so. But I have people coming over today, my cousin and my friend, so I'm not gonna be alone this whole time. So, let me take a bite first. So overall, my first night wasn't bad at all. I, I slept on the couch because my bed is not together yet, and I don't know how to do that type of stuff, so I didn't put it together. Um, but I was so tired. I didn't get back until 1 a.m. because um, we started late. Both of the guys they got off kind of late, later than expected, so that kind of pushed us back. And then like it's a lot to pack up a truck. Um, but thank God the unloading went really well because um, like I said yesterday, I live on the ground level. I wasn't too happy about it, but but it's starting to show its convenience already. So um, it just made unloading much easier. And um, then I had to go back to the old place, get the last bit of stuff that was in there, um, make sure everything was turned off, um, make sure that everything was just like kind of empty on my part uh, because you know, just have like that random like board game that's still in your closet. Like I had to make sure all that type of stuff was gone. Um, but long story short, again, I got here around like 1 a.m. St stood up for, stayed up for like a little bit, um, probably like 30 minutes on my phone. I didn't do any work. I was so tired. I didn't do any work last night like when I got back I'm telling you it took like everything and the guys were tired I was tired I was like slump I'm going to sleep so I probably stayed up for like another 30 minutes and then went to bed around 1 30. this is when the weird stuff happens I know I'm probably super dark and I'm gonna have to work on the lighting in here <laughs> but um this is when it gets super weird so I was asleep and I heard yelling like and I can't remember if it was a dream or not but it was like I want to say the girl was named Joanna and it was like they sounded drunk it was like no blase blase but and then I, I, I can't even put the context of what they were saying together because I was asleep but the weird part is I can't tell if it was a dream or real like I'm still trying to figure out like what went on last night so overall I felt pretty safe I wasn't scared at first I was just like me being me negative I was like what if I wake up and there's just somebody standing over top of me like but it didn't happen so that was a blessing and um i'm starting to like my little place already like um i haven't done anything like i said i'm about to start working after i eat my breakfast and then um i guess when the girls get here we'll go shopping so <laughs> see you soon
here we are in Spice Six eating before we go shopping because we're starving. We got Rachel here. We got Sydney here. Are you in it? <laughs> and um, we're gonna get a quick bite and then, don't you love this angle? No. <laughs> so we're gonna get a quick bite. <laughs> Rachel is, uh, I swear she stay playing my vlog. But we're gonna get a quick bite and then we're gonna go get some necessitatas. So, <laughs> okay. <laughs> yesterday um we went to spice six as you saw and um i had a lot of leftovers so i was like i'm not throwing this food out and um eating it for breakfast so but this is going to be the last clip of this video um because i'm kind of finalizing my moving weekend today is sunday and um i just want to recap so i moved on friday friday evening friday night went shopping yesterday for like some necessities like stuff that i need for the first few weeks and today um, i'm just going to be unpacking i'm going to set up my internet right now i have internet but i need to set up my own internet so my connection can be stronger but other than that that's all i'm doing today i'm going to just chill out try to because i have to go to work tomorrow so i'm going to try to get my mind right <coughs> get my mind right for tomorrow um kind of i'm getting my bed put together today hopefully so um i'll be able to sleep in my bed versus sleeping on the couch which i don't mind this couch is actually very comfortable um so i know we'll be taking a lot of naps on here but um, all in all, I'm very excited, you guys. I was a little nervous, um, and then I kind of had a suck me out moment um, yesterday. No, last night. No. The first night, because I'm just like, oh my gosh, like, I'm really by myself. Like, this is crazy. But all in all, like I said, I'm happy. I'm excited. Um, stay tuned. Apartment tour coming soon. Um, don't know when, but it's coming soon. I just want to make sure that my apartment is presentable before I show anything, like, for real, for real. So, yeah. But um, here's a hot mess. I haven't done anything to it in, like, weeks, so excuse it. But, um, yeah. So, again, um, stay tuned. This is my new place, so if you see a change of scenery, just know that I moved. And yeah, thank you for watching. If you're watching, please like, comment, and subscribe. And if you have a unique moving story or, you know, ever experienced like, wow, I'm really on my own now, let me know in the comment section. Let's talk, let's chit chat, and yeah, stay tuned, and I'll catch you in the next video. Bye!